Assalamu alaikum. I think that a lot of the uh, sort of alpha maleists and uh, red pill guys who aren't thinking in the context of qawama are a little bit confused about something. If you believe that men are the greater sex, if you believe that men are stronger and more capable and more competent, and I believe that, they seem to think that that equates to greater entitlement, greater privilege. It doesn't. It equates to you doing a lot more of the hard work. Think about if you were working at a company or if you're working on a team and you are the most competent, capable member of the team, what does that mean? You have to have lower expectations of the other team members and you have to do more of the work. There's greater responsibility on your shoulders because you have greater capacity. But I tend to think that a lot of these guys who talk about how great men are and how much respect men deserve are the least capable group of men because they want the the honor and status of masculinity without the substance, but that's not how it works. The stronger person is expected to lift the heavier things, and that's the case with men. You have fewer privileges, you have fewer entitlements, you have fewer rights than women. Fewer, not more. Because you can bear it, and that's your job. Jazakumullahu khairam, assalamu alaikum.